Greetings, Pokey fans! Michael here, and welcome to the newest episode of my Pokemon in Let's play my very first journey through this critically acclaimed Pokemon fan game. If you haven't enjoyed the series, don't forget to drop a like, make sure you answer the comment question, and if you missed the last episode, make sure you check it out so you know what the booty's going on. We have three more battles, I think. Here against the Timeless. Um, because I think there's the first six, and then once I've beaten the first six, I get to battle the seventh. Um, did I already go in this door? I have not. Okay, alright, we're battling Large-Eyed King Man. Let's do this. Hello again, Michael. I suppose it's time to introduce myself. My name is King Vesserin. I found two regions, one very, very far away, named after me, as well as Torin itself. Definitely the oldest person here. I tamed the Wilderlands of the planet into a glorious region with my own two hands. Whenever you mind that, let's get going, shall we? He's dressed like that, uh, that guy from, uh, the Elite Four from Kalos. He's got a Bisharp. Ooh, an excellent start for us. Aura Sphere should Oko this thing to the next dimension. Glory be! <laughs> Cobalion! I would say let's just Aura Sphere this thing, but since we are also weak to its fighting and I don't know if we will outspeed, I think Lumiera is the safer option. Right? Either Lumiera or Phobia. Excuse me! Lumiera. Well, let's go Lumiera because she's lower level, give her some more experience. Flamethrower! Oh, come on. Alright, I don't care if you close combat me, it does way less than Iron Head did. Cobalion's so cool. I love Cobalion's shiny. Some people, like, I've said before my favorite legendary shiny is Cobalion. Um, and some people were like, what? It looks exactly the same. No! No, it doesn't! <laughs> I always forget about freaking Gudra and its water moves. By the way, I did heal in between, um, in between battles. Or, uh, in between episodes, I, like, left, healed, and came back. Just figured I'd get my PP back to max, that kind of thing. I always forget, every Gudra has a water move. Every single Gudra. If it doesn't have a water move, it's not really a Gudra. <laughs> We're gonna go with Phobia for this Heatran. Because while we are weak to fire, we have the four times super effective move. That should Oko. Viva la Revolution! Gyarados? Okay, I know how to beat a Gyarados. Haha! -ha! Your Intimidate doesn't work, it doesn't matter because I'm a special attacker, but it still didn't work. Is this last Pokemon gonna be Aegislash? Cause that would be, no, it's Salamence, okay. Oh, two turns in a row of, oh, it's a Mega Salamence. Ugh. Oh, that's right, I resist the flying move. <laughs> he, he's dumb. It's 2D Sprite's kind of weird. It like really makes him have to get so tiny. <laughs> not bad, kid, you're not bad at all. You just have... Now you just have to get through the rest of us. Okay, so one more, and then the leader, whoever that is. I know Red is one of them, because they said our... Oh, Red's the leader, that's right. Because they said at some point, like, our leader just stopped showing up to Mount Silver. So Red is the leader. That is not a big reveal. They've already made that very obvious. Alright, well... Uh... Who's the, I wonder who the last one's gonna be though. Oh, let's put uh, let's put Gil in front. Gil's only 87. Oops. And uh, I can't remember which door it is. Okay, that was the one I've already done. I don't actually even know if there are wild Pokemon here. Oh, it's N! What? Oh, that's cool. 
You're the trainer that's supposed to take the auger's place. I see. Any powerful trainer can save a region. It says nothing about your character. But your Pokemon, they can tell me things that no action can. So let's begin. Let me hear the voices of your Pokemon. That's awesome. Is that okay? Since this thing, he probably has Reshiram and Zekrom. I do think Evolving Phobia is the best Pokemon for this battle. Come on, come on, come on! Yes, yes! Viva la Revolution! Zoroark. That was a Zoroark. I just heard the cry, and I saw the name. That was quite the... Well, man, I always forget about Zora War being a thing. <laughs> does Karakost have Sturdy? Yes, it does. I guess we'll just Seed Bomb again. Yeah, okay, that's right. I'm glad I did, because then I was like, oh wait, he's probably gonna full restore. It seems like each of these guys have one full restore. Okay, Karakasta goes down. Archaeops, we will change our Pekarhush. Let's go Gil. It's awkward. Gosh, freaking. Yeah! I don't actually know how heavy Archaeops is, so I figured, okay, now here's the actual Zekrom. It's radiating a bursting aura. Earthquake. We do outspeed, let's go! Aw, oh, man. Booty, booty, booty. Rocking everywhere. This is Earth Power. All right, well, this means that Moonblast, a freaking Reshiram, Kling Clang. Do I have somebody who's a physical attacker who can battle Steel types? Yes, I do. Your Earthquake is physical. Oh, so close. All right, then the last one's gonna be Reshiram, which is unfortunate because Reshiram is only weak to rock and fire, rock and ground, and all of my Pokemon that have, well, I guess Vegan doesn't isn't actually weak to fire because of Thick Fat, so let's just keep Vegan in. Oh wow, we tanked the crap out of that. <laughs> Goodness me, vegan, you are so good. <laughs> All right, we beat in. Thank you. What? Who? <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me. <laughs> Never expected Pokémon to say such things. You're truly a stellar trainer. I really hope you can get through all of the timeless. All right, well now we need to battle the last one. Revives are right here, you gotta revive Phobia. And Hyper Potion. So these battles, you know, they haven't been too difficult, but also they haven't been super easy. I have had at least one Pokemon faint in every single battle. So, I mean a large part of, this would be a lot harder if I was on set battle mode. What? What is this? Oh, gosh dang it. Did I miscount? How many timeless are- Dawn? <laughs> what? <laughs> Ugh. I freaking thought that- I thought there were set seven timeless total. Cynthia, Alon, Suzerain, Steven, King Vesseran, 
Uh, N. I thought there were seven total, not seven plus a leader. I guess I was wrong. So you're this incredible trainer I've heard so much about, yeah? You don't look that impressive. When I was younger than you, I took down Team Galactic and even captured the Pokemon in control of space and time. I think you might be outmatched here. Good luck, though. Dun, 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 dun. All right, let's hope this doesn't suck. We outspeed, let's go! The heavy land shark with an anchor in his head outspeeds the lanky fire monkey, and that really surprised me. Was not expecting that. Palkia, what is Palkia weak to? Dragon water, it's only weak to f dragon and fairy. And I think I would rather go for dragon pulse, because it being a water type means that, uh, it's, uh, it, it has a good move against uh, my fire chandelier thing, so. Plus, this is good because Orisir is going to help with Dialga, because I'm sure it has both. Ah. Bet we can KO with Vacuum Wave. Oh no, she, she full restores here. Yeah. Alright, and now we KO with Vacuum Wave. This is that priority, though! Dialga! Can we aura sphere you here? This definitely Oko's. Oh. We survived! Let's go! <laughs> I saw the aura sphere and then I saw it on Raphael and I was like, what? Am I confused? What's happening? <laughs> Empoleon! Yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna change. We're kind of hurting a bit. I love Empoleon. Uh, Thunderbolt. Aha! Dontana! So cool, but also horrifically weak to ice. So, what are you gonna do? I just splashed water up onto my nose. Oh, <laughs> it's Frostlass. Yes. We're gonna heavy slam you. Whoa. That's extremely creepy. Did N not have a Mega? I just realized. Password to our leader should be clear now that you've beaten all of us. Good luck. Okay, well. Did N, did N have a Mega? I'm like super brain farting right now. Because they had Karakasta, Karakasta, Archaeops, Clink Clang, Zoroark. Yeah, he didn't have a Mega. Or if he did, it never got to Mega Evolve. Maybe that was on purpose. Eh, who knows. All right, well, since uh, since Red's the, the leader, I don't think a Snorlax sweep is gonna be that effective because of Charizard. Because <laughs> that's gonna resist all of my moves. Um, and it's gonna have flying moves, which we are weak to. Unlike the fire moves. But let's do it. Hey, dude. All right. Red time. What is on his hat? Is, does this sprite have a hole in his head? Is that what it is? Is that that's just the rock behind him? That's actually kind of funny. Oh, not a good lead. Aha. Oops. Should I set up stealth rocks? Ooh, yeah, okay. Maybe I should have, but we, uh... We cannot beat a Blastoise. 
wonder what Mega he's going to have. Oh, so close. Oh, wait. He's going to heal this turn. All right, let's just go for it. I mean, that was a decent strategy, trying to go for the flinch, but... Charizard. Let's see if we can actually do it. I think maybe he might be ha he might have Mega Y? There's no way he has Mega X, because Alon already had that. Earthquake is immune. Seed Bomb is... Four times resisted, so that's 0.25 times 1.5, which is like a third-ish. Drain Punch isn't stab, but it's only two times, yeah, Drain Punch is stronger. Oh, the flinch sucks. Can we survive another one? I think we actually can. Focus Blast. That was awesome! I, that crit was so cool! <laughs> oh, he's got more than one full restore? It's fine. We're still getting more HP back. Beat a Charizard with a grass type! Let's go! <laughs> Snorlax! <gasps> The Battle of the Century! That's actually happened several times throughout these timeless battles. The regular, the original versus the Delta. The Haxorus's, the Metagross's, and now the Snorlax's. And I like that. I'll be stunned if this doesn't Oko, though. Yep, super effective max attack. Venusaur! What's his last one gonna be? Eee! Earthquake's neutral. <laughs> Mewtwo! Okay, I wasn't ex I, I didn't foresee Mewtwo. But now that I think about it, that makes sense. Okay, he's got Mega Mewtwo Y. Alright. That's his Mega. Oh, let's go! <laughs> a vegan belly drum sweep. Glory be. Why is this sprite glitched? That's disappointing. Hey, Michael, it's Orion! Please tell me you're here, we need to talk. I need your help, it's about Reshiram. Please, please, please come to my gym. The one in Sun Touch City, hurry. Okay. Congratulations, Michael. You've beaten all of us, the strongest trainers in history. Because of that, we feel you'd be the best person to protect this region with us. I want to grant you the title of Augur. The third Augur, the new protector of the region. Congratulations. Obviously, this gives you responsibility, but nothing you aren't already doing. And now there's so many people to help. For example, the people at the Scientist Club would love your assistance. Perhaps somebody in Dayron Town or the Nightmare Realm would have something for you. You'll definitely get calls from time to time from friends asking for your aid. And I'd like to entrust you with these. Crystal pieces! I think they'll be safest in your hands, but I want to reiterate again, the reach is an open door to you now. Explore! Exploring will be rewarded. A keen eye could be rewarded with a battle frontier. Qu quests and a whole new region to explore. Good luck, Michael. Thank you. Dope. Well, uh, I guess we're, we're gonna go to... We're gonna go to, um, yeah. We're gonna go to, what is Orion's gym? Talk to him about Reshiram. Cause I mean, that's what I got a call for. So I mean, what else, what else is there to do? <laughs> All right, but first we must heal this squad. And now we summon a flight, Pikataxi. Where does he, where is his gym? It was Sun Touch City, that's right. 
and the gym was in the top region, so... Up we go. Nope. Hey, dude. Oh, goodness, thank you for coming. You gotta help me. I, I can't believe I was that stupid. I wasn't being careful. I was about to close out the gym when Tay and Surprise attacked me. Tyrem? He had ki- Why did I just call him Tyrem? I was saying Tayen, and then I saw Kyurem on the screen and said Tyrem. <laughs> he had Kyurem black again somehow. I didn't see it coming and helped me clean up my feet and ran off with Reshiram again. Such a screw up, man. You gotta help me. Maybe I don't deserve to be friends with Reshiram, but if Tayen has Kyurem B and Reshiram, well, I both know what Tayen's gonna try and do with him. It starts with an S and it ends in... with. <laughs> <laughs> Starts with an S and ends with an Ummon the Original Dragon. <laughs> Do you think you could help me? I can't think of anyone else to turn to. You're the auger now, after all. Listen, how about this? I'm gonna see if I can track him down using my bond with Reshiram. It's a it's a stretch, but well, it's the best I can hope for. Do you think you could check the black market? You know where the perfection base was stationed? You might have head there. Hopefully this works out. I'll try and meet up with you later. And thanks. I'd say I owe you one, but I think I owe you like twenty at this point. All right, let's go. Also, if you can hear the truck making noise outside, I apologize. What are they doing? Why are they being so noisy right now? I am recording, clearly I have things to do. Oh, that is not what I meant to click. Crap. Well, we're gonna be stuck here for a couple minutes <laughs> while I try to find the specific box for the Pokemon Center. It's just not their best feature in this game. What the heck? Get on the freaking... What's the zoom in button? There we go. Okay. So I just need to zoom in excessively far every time. <laughs> Alright. We're here in the black market. Walk past the Pokemon that have been fighting to the death for the last several months. Oh, okay, all right. I, if all of you don't just shut it, I swear. Yeah, we'll stop when you stop experimenting on Pokemon. Isn't that right? Who is this guy? Yeah, yeah, stop the abuse, yeah. We'll keep coming. We'll bring more and more of us each time. You can't take everyone down in the Torin region, even if you were the champion. Emphasis on the word were, by the way. We all saw the match on TV. Leader of the Perfection Cult? Disgusting. You've been outed to the entire region. You're going down, buster. Yeah, we'll just keep coming back. For the love. I'm out. I can't do this. I can't work in private with protesters bothering me. Protesters bothering me every five minutes. You dispose of them and they just keep coming back. I'm leaving. Find some other base to work at that's more quiet. Turn the place into a gluten-free, vegan, homeless shelter for all I care. I don't need it anymore. Michael, have you come to rub your victory in? I'm already being forced to move because these insufferable protesters will not just leave me alone. Not that I'm quitting, mind you, just moving to somewhere less... loud. Why are you here, then? Make it quick. Tayen? I haven't seen him for ages. He's plotting something, probably. He's been talking non-stop about the original dragon, even though that plan went nowhere. He's as stubborn as ever. A complete idiot. Anyways, we don't have that crystal piece anymore. It's not like we could summon something that strong now. No thanks, by the way, to you. I'm out of here. I'm done with you. I'm tempted to move out of Torin, but I have a couple last ideas to try before I do. Good luck finding Tan. Really couldn't care less about him at this point. Hmm. Hey, that scumbag was just talking to you. 
What's going on? Do you know him? Oh man, I didn't even recognize you. How could I forget the hero that exposed the rat for what he really is? You were fantastic. You're definitely my favorite champion we've had so far. And, well, the second best auger. My name's Gale. It's a pleasure to meet you. Listen, you looking for Tan? He's the blue-haired turd stain. <laughs> I love the, the language. That works for Jerk Nozzle who just left, right? I can I can find him for you. I'm good at that sort of thing. You seem like you're suspicious of me. Listen, I'm not... I'm an environmentalist. But it's not the Earth I'm fighting for. It's all the little creatures that can't defend themselves. Original Dragon, Mewtwo, overpowered Pokemon with no regard for their surroundings. There's too many little Pokemon that can be hurt by that. My mom, had, my mom had this task, and her aunt before her, and her second cousin before her, and his estranged stepfather before him. <laughs> what? <laughs> and so on. We were chosen by a legendary Pokemon. We protect the ecosystem. Zygarde? This was their duty, and now it's mine. You shouldn't underestimate me. Let me show you why. What? All right, we're fighting environmentalist Gale and his stun disc. You're not weak to me. Oops. You want to beat you, Gale? Cease your actions. I'm just trying to find Tayen. Why are you attacking me? Oh, come on, Stunfisk. Why you gotta be like that? That was an extremely dumb switch. Why would you <laughs> Oh, well. Okay. Azumarill. Yeah, yeah, we'll switch out away from our in Azumarill. He's got interestingly like all like roundish Pokemon. He definitely doesn't have like super, he definitely doesn't have OP Pokemon, you know what I mean? They're all like Pokemon whose base stat totals aren't incredibly high. So that's interesting. Sunflora, another example. Oh! It unleafed? What is the, he just get an Omni boost? And it was frozen and it defrosted. Because he immediately used Sunny Day. That was quite the range of emotions that just occurred. <laughs> Let's have Strike at. Yeah, we, we're, we're gonna... We're gonna switch. Why you gotta thrash me like that, dude? That ain't right. Goodbye, senor. Zygarde! I knew it. Oh, he's got the Dogue version! Bye, Felicia! Well, looks like I lost. Yeah, what did you expect, dude? I know exactly which Pokemon you're gonna send it out before you send it out. I have this interesting sort of... Prophet... Prophet? Prophecy? Prophet... I can see the future. That didn't go quite as I planned, but I made my point. Not someone to mess around with. Zygarde is a unique legendary. It's not just one Pokemon. It's a hive mind. Hundreds of thousands of tiny Pokemon working together to guard the ecosystem and the rest of the world. Of course, it's more complicated than that. There are cores, cells, a whole bunch of doohickeys that go into it. But you get the drift. The truth is Zygarde is everywhere cores all over the world. It's like a network that lets it observe the ecosystem everywhere at once. I've been using it to watch that blue-haired freak waltz across the region. If you're looking for him, he's last seen in the No Man's Lands. Well, yeah, obviously you haven't heard of the No Man's Lands. If it were a popular destination spot, it wouldn't be called the No Man's Lands. Now would it? There's not much there. It's all unclaimed territory between regions. Super dangerous. No cities, no towns, no regions, no routes, no people. Just wilderness. Ooh, this sounds interesting. Nobody aside from the first auger ever even bothered to head out there. And yes, before you asked, I watched him too. Can you blame me? Look at the guy. Great jeans. Anyway, <laughs> anyways, there was something in Gaia Town near his gym that he used to get there. Not sure what it was. Not sure what it is or was. You should definitely check it out though. Something in Gaia Town might lead you to the bag face in no man's lands. Not sure all the specifics, but you'll need this. Hiking was- 
We can finally rock climb! Yes! <laughs> it's been 10,000 years! Hey, check out the Battle Frontier after we're done with this business. Uh, I might stop by the Battle Frontier, but I will definitely not be doing any sort of competing in that, because I do not feel like breeding competitive Pokemon in this game. It's over by Rangan Town. It's unfinished, but you can use those boots to sneak in, you know? Good luck, kiddo. Nice to see a friendly face here and not one of those perfection di uh, jerks. <laughs> Excuse me. Gotta follow the Mafia, dude. All right. Well... I don't have that key, or whatever it is. Guys, that, I think, is a good place to wrap up this episode. Um, I think next episode, I'll probably do some looking in to see, like, you know, what, where I can go to get rock climb that's, like, interesting. To Where can I use my new rock climb powers that will be interesting and stuff like that? Or if I should just head straight to Gaia Town. <laughs> because I'm definitely excited to finally go there and see what the future holds. Guys, that is going to be the end of this episode. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to drop a like. Make sure you answer the comment question, and that is all I have for now. So until next time, big fans, gotta catch them all!